Hey, it's the Terminian Hero here, and we're playing some more Metroid Prime 2. And we are headed to something interesting. We are here in the Sanctuary Fortress. We have activated our second little ring here. So now we can, like, spider ball up here. This is the wrong side. But yeah, on this side, we can spider ball up here. And then we can speed boost through this window. And then, you know, power bomb through this door. I said power. Oh, wait. Well, that's inconvenient. Is there, like, any easy-to-access ammo here? Not really. Come on, there's gotta be something I can break somewhere. Come down to me, elevator. There must be some containers somewhere nearby. Not a single container over here. Why is this happening? Come on, game. You, give me power bombs, please. Why don't you give me power bombs? There we go. That's all I needed was the one power bomb. And we're all good to go. Now we've got to blast through a window that's already broken. That's not as cool. All right. Now let's not screw this up, because we only had one. And what is this? The Dark Pirates are fighting Dark Samus here. Bioscan complete. Target DNA confirmed. Dark Samus. Target is energizing herself, building an internal supply of Phazon energy to dangerously high levels. That didn't go into our logbook, though. So, she's absorbing Phazon. Let's go get her. Nice, more powerbomb stuff. Now I have easy access to it. Get a bit more ammo here. Alright, let's get her. Of course she's gone by now. We still only have two power bomb ammo. And now only three, all that. And we still only have three ammo after opening all that stuff. Oh well. Let's move on here. There she is.
She's caused a lot of trouble for us, but it's finally time for a second fight with her. Morphology, Dark Samus, Reborn, Enhanced, and Vengeful. Enhanced beam system and boost attacks added to arsenal. Stealth field generator present in armor. So yeah, here's our second fight against Dark Samus. We're fighting her on the elevator. Because of course we are, and she just like totally froze me or something. Well there's that other power bomb ammo. Not that it'll help us in this fight. But you know, she's dark, so light beam is probably a good idea here. We're heading up this elevator. This elevator is not endless. Here we are at the top. Fighting at the top of the tower. I already had to deal with the boost guardian. I don't really want to deal with more boost ball. Okay, let me out of that. She's in particles right now. Wait, there she is. Where'd she go? I see you. Why is it bouncing off her? She's still invisible. I know she sometimes has that invulnerability. There we go, got her a bit more. Running out of light beam ammo. But she's also running out of health. Alright, we can see her normally again. I can't charge up my light beam anymore. I don't have enough ammo for that. Come on, I only want to hit you when you're vulnerable. Alright, out of light beam ammo. I'll have to super missile her. Come on, Dark Samus, quit boosting around. Thought that one was coming right at me, but it bounced off something first. Next time you're vulnerable, you're dead. Unless you make me un-auto aim. I was locked on and then I somehow unlocked even though I never let go of the lock on. Stop it! That was awesome. I finished her off with an unlocked on super missile. Is there anything to scan here? A 
Because, you know, once I leave here, I can't really come back here. There's a portal. So I guess let's check that out. Since we can't come back here, there's not going to be anything that's actually missable, but there could always be missable scans. But whatever, I guess let's go to Dark Ether. We definitely want to get some more light ammo here. We got up to 50. I guess that'll have to do. We can get a little more. Wasn't as much as I was hoping for. But whatever. So what can we do in here exactly? I mean, I see a spinner. That'll move this spider ball track around. It's worth noting that there's like no safety in here. I see some safety by this portal and some up here. Again, still trying for some light beam ammo. Yeah, let's get out of here. To somewhere more safe. And here we are, there's an ability, Echo Visor. That sounds like an interesting ability. Do I see, like, Dark Samus particles? I, I think I did. Because of course she's not dead yet. Anyways, let's get this visor. Echo visor acquired. So this is going to be a weird looking one. So yeah, let's actually take a look at this visor here. Everything is lines, but yeah, we've got some things we can point out here. First, let's scan this, since, you know, we're not gonna be coming back up here. But yeah, Echo Visor. So we can find these points that are transmitting signals. And we gotta hit them to uh, undo these locks. And now we should be able to take the elevator back down.
So where was the switch that Dark Samus hit? Like, where was it? I don't see it. I didn't see it before, and I don't see it now. Like, I legitimately just don't think it's here. Oh, well, whatever. Can we actually take the elevator back up? It looks like we can, but we have no need to. So maybe you can go back up there. But never back into, like, the actual elevator section, because that's a loading screen now. So why are the doors locked? This concerns me. Why are the doors locked? This phase on that was back there is gone now. Oh, does that door just stay locked forever? Cause I was, no, this is locked too. So I was going to say, because I'm right about not being able to go back into that elevator shaft, but I, I'm not entirely sure why the doors are locked now. Oh, I bet I have to use the echo visor, yeah. But it doesn't say... Oh, there's like some thing here that I can destroy. Now all doors unlocked. I guess I can go back to that area. I just have no reason to. Now this is a place where we can definitely use our Echo Visor. But can we use it yet, is the question. So here's some sort of special gate. This will play some tones for us. Or we can play some tones. How does this work? Maybe we can't do this yet. No, we can't. Okay. Well, never mind then, but that is related to the Echo Visor. We're just missing another crucial item to solving that puzzle. So where do we want to go now? So I don't think we can get there yet. Where do we actually want to go? We can't go in there. I am so confused. Where exactly does the Echo Visor allow us to go? Is there, like, an obvious place in Dark Aether we can go with it? Not really, although I haven't gone out there, even though I clearly could. But that's not related to the Echo Visor. Is 
Is there anything up here I can do? I mean, there's this thing. That moves that into place temporarily, so I can use the kinetic orb cannon. And drop into here instead of, you know, going past there. So that gets us our missile expansion. So that's cool. Can use a spinner to get us out of here. So if there's sound-based stuff in this direction, maybe we want to continue in that direction. Or maybe we don't. Maybe we don't. I'm definitely not headed in the direction I thought I was headed in. But we still got a missile expansion out of it, so that's something. I have no clue which direction to go in. Where does this direction even lead? This map is so hard to read because of the multiple layers and stuff. I mean, I don't think I want to go back down here. But maybe I do. I just have no clue anymore. I just have no clue where the echo visor could help me. I guess let's use this elevator. Because the thing is, the Echo Visor is usually used with a different ability that I don't have yet. But it can sometimes be used without that ability, but it's always much less obvious in those cases. I would really like it if the little hint thing popped up. Because I am clueless here. I know that there was like a Sonic thing back in Aegon of all places, but like... I need another ability to do that full thing. And now I am not going in the direction I wanted to go. I get so lost in this place. But we can at least save it while we're here.
So here's the thing, I'm pretty sure there was a Sonic thing in the pathway up above here. Will you get out of here, Resbit? I don't want to deal with you, Resbit. Get out of here, Resbit. Oh my gosh. Resbit, please. So I think I want to go this way. Because there was something Sonic related over here. But I don't know if we can do that without the other item we need. And I don't know where the other item that we need is. Okay. This is where we want to go. Yeah, this leads us straight into another portal. Portal that I definitely want to go in. This is the way forward. I know this now. I would like to have some more health, honestly. Man, I can't stand these things, but I think the... I think the Dark Visor helps with them. Not really. Well then, just get me out of here. Sounds like, yeah, there's more stuff to do with the Echo Visor here. There we go, I've got a thing I can scan here now. So now it's letting me into here. It looks like, but what can I do in here? Oh, there's a portal down here. Okay. I'll take that, and now I'm exactly where I want to be. So there's a thing that we were supposed to scan earlier, and we did, thankfully. Because, yeah, we can't scan it now. So if we head up here... A boss fight starts, and now we can't get out of the morph ball. Please let me up. So yeah, we need to fight this with spider ball and boost. We want to hit this, that little target that came down. That thing. Thankfully, attacking those has it drop some health. But yeah, so this is a little boss fight against that security drone that we scanned a while ago. Oh, come on. Bring that down again. There we go. We've done some real damage there. Now we can climb up. Where is the way up? Of course, it was directly under the camera's blind spot. And now we don't have a full track all the way around. That's gonna be their way of making this harder. Oh, 
there we go. We've destroyed three of those, so the weak point's probably gonna come down now. It's another one down. Let's move on up. Now, this is probably going to be split into three sections. Yes, it is. That was awkward. Come on, weak point. No, that's not where I'm trying to aim. No, come on. Let me up. Sometimes those bombs just don't let me get up. It's so hard to hit this thing now. Is this thing actually going to kill me? Because I cannot hit this for the life of me. How did that not hit? Oh my gosh, come on, I cannot hit this thing. How is that not hitting? Oh my gosh. Finally. Give me the energy, please. I'm so dead. Why? What was all that all about? Okay then. Why couldn't I hit that thing? So do I still have the thing that was... Didn't I pick up something down here? I don't even remember. If I'm missing something here, I'll get it later. I'll check in the recording later. For now, I just want to head straight back to that boss. I don't know why it was so hard to hit that thing. Should be easy to get back there now that I know where we're going. And now that I know I have to keep using this echo visor. To 
just have to hit all these weird targets that it's kind of awkward to know that they're there. But I know now, so now we're right back to the boss, okay. Let's try this again. Hopefully it won't be so awkward this time. See, this part's easy. How did that miss? It's weird, because it doesn't shoot, like, straight out. There we go, that's part one done. That was super easy. Of course, the, this thing is right in the camera's blind spot again, because this game loves playing a practical joke. Like, when you do, when you boost off these, you're supposed to go straight out, but it, it a lot of times just doesn't. It's like you aim to the side a bit. Doesn't make any sense. Alright, that's two down. We're making quick work of this guy now. But the first two phases of this weren't hard before. It was the third phase that was hard. There we go. I got that now. This is actually going well now, although getting off the floor of here is still stupid. Come on. Why is this thing so hard to hit? I mean, I get it. It's a boss fight. It's not supposed to be easy. There we go. Now we should be able to destroy this thing. Let me up, please. Let me up. Of course, the weak point went up right when I had to leave. There we go. My goodness, why was that so difficult? Do we even get a reward for this fight? So I'm not sure if we do. We don't, do we? No, we just get up here so we can move on through the level. Well, all right then. And then this barrier blocks us. Of course, we gotta use the echo visor some more. All right. So if we look in the background, there's a specific pathway we want to fall down. And I think I already went the wrong way. Okay. Well, let's try that again.
Let's go down the left one this time. There we go, there's our missile expansion. And let's head back up one more time, and this time not go down. Fill up on some health here. That'll be some health. And here we are, in the outdoor segment. Well, I did, okay, yeah, this is outdoor. Is there a save room somewhere here? There's some lore, is this the last lore? Oh, it's not quite the last lore. Sanctuary Falls. Our battered forces gathered in the Sanctuary Fortress to prepare for the inevitable siege there. They didn't wait long. Wave after wave of Ain assaulted the greatest of our fortresses with one goal in mind, to seize the energy there. The Ain turned the ma machines of Sanctuary against our warriors. And soon all was lost. The energy of Sanctuary was taken by the Ain. Only one energy controller remained on Ether. That's so close to all the lore. Don't you destroy me now. So this looks familiar. We have our energy tank here. And now we can make these grapple things come down, right? Yeah, there we go. So there is a save on the other side there. There might be another save closer by on this side, but I know for a fact that there's a save over here, so I'm using this one. So yeah, let's just get over here and save. Okay, so we fought a weird boss that we had to do in Morph Ball form. I don't know why those are always so tricky for me. But we are going to continue more through Sanctuary Fortress next time. I'm the Terminian Hero, and I will see you then.